Election campaigns often provide fertile ground for online misinformation to spread. In Sweden, this Sunday's election is going to be crucial, not just amid the war in Ukraine and the country's relations with its neighbour Russia, but also crucial when it comes to Sweden's climate policy. Here in the Cube, we have found an example of online climate misinformation spreading in recent months. Now, this image claims to show two weather forecasts by the same broadcaster, one allegedly in 1986 and another from this summer. People online are claiming that this is proof of so-called climate hysteria. They are accusing the broadcaster of changing and altering their graphics and colours to exaggerate the impacts of global warming. Here, online users are claiming that temperatures have not changed in Sweden since the 1980s. And the claim was even amplified online by an MP for the right-wing moderate party. But this claim is misleading. Here in the Cube, we analysed those two images. And we found that actually the first photo of a weather forecast was not from 1986. It actually comes from 2016, as you can see the date here. This was shared by the state-controlled broadcaster SVT, showing the weather forecast for that day. And the second image is also not from this summer. It actually comes from last year, 2021. This was by a different broadcaster, TV4, showing the ground temperature forecasts for that day. So these images are actually just five years apart, and they were shared by different broadcasters in Sweden, who used different graphics and colours to display ground temperature and weather forecasts. Indeed, journalists in Sweden say they have seen this same exact image being shared in previous summers, particularly by online users who try to downplay or deny climate change. It's something we've seen also spreading this summer in other European countries, such as France and the United Kingdom. But in Sweden, this is just another example about how online misinformation can spread during an election campaign.